making PPR materials in Blender is not a simple process, and to be honest about it, it should be better. But as always, the Blender community turns the majority of Blender complex processes into simple ones. So here comes the role of today's add-on, Simple Bake. Simple Bake is the definitive baking solution for Blender. In short, it allows you to simply bake PPR and other textures. Blender provides a very powerful way to create complex PBR materials by using nodes. However, what should be a simple process of baking and exporting these materials for use with other software or systems is surprisingly difficult. Simple Bakes aim to address this problem. Simple Bake is an add-on or tool that provides a one-click solution for simply baking PBR maps for materials created in Blender. However, Simple Bake isn't just an add-on for PBR. You can easily bake all of the traditional cycles baking models along with other kind of specialist maps like ambient occlusion, curvature, thickness, vertex color, and color ID. Now let us dive deep into what the add-on offers for PBR baking and traditional or cycles baking. So for PPR baking, the add-on offers the simplest process. You can just select what texture you want and Simple Bake will spit them out for you. It allow you to create complex materials. It allow you to create complex materials the way you want to. You can create your PPR materials in the usual way. Have as many materials on your object as possible. Use multiple principal BSDF and emission shaders in those materials to get the results you want, which is something that sets Simple Bake apart from the other add-ons. You can also use mix shader nodes to mix them together however you want. And you can use whatever input to those shaders. The add-on also has a fully flexible channel packing and you can bake to target, meaning baking multiple objects to a single target object with ease. It has options for ray distance and case selections. And the last feature for the PBR baking is the integration with Sketchfab. The add-on provides you with a Sketchfab API key to upload PBR models and textures to Sketchfab with one click. Textures will be automatically matched to materials in Sketchfab. Now for the traditional or the cycles baking, the add-on allow you to bake any of the traditional cycles baking modes. Simple Bake will handle all of the node setups and tons of other things that makes baking in Blender a pain. You can add as many materials as possible on your object and you can choose your color space for baked images. And also you can choose whether or not to use this color space in your exported files. The add-on also offers presets, so you can create and save your own presets and use them across your Blender files. Also it offers bake in the background feature, which allow you to queue up a number of different baking tasks to bake in the background while you continue to work in Blender. Each task can be given a name and when it's finished, you can import the textures or the objects into Blender, so you can keep doing what you are doing. Another great feature is that you can keep doing what you are already doing and that's because there is no new workflow to learn, no special node groups or materials to use and no limitations on the complexity of your materials, just simple baking based on your existing workflow. The add-on also offers special maps, so you can bake a number of special maps including ambient occlusion, curvature, thickness, vertex colors, and color ID. Simple Bake also comes with tons of other features, like automatically exporting baked maps to external files, automatically exporting your mesh to external files like FBX and GLTF, batch baking and folder organization, no limits on materials, bake multiple objects to a single texture set, smart UV handling, easy to use and well documented, support for UDIMs, automatic updates, and so much more that you can check out on the add-on page on the Blender Market, linked in the description. Now if you want to check out this add-on, link is in the description. Tell me in the comments below what do you think about this add-on. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one. Thank you for watching and goodbye.